this message goes out to my PlayStation friends and this video is not going to be 100% perfect because even if I get a little bit sad or if I mess up on something that I'm going to say it's just that you know I never thought you know my best friend could betray me and you know I talked about her in my you know past video it's just she accused me of something that I didn't really do but it did kind of look like that but not really because you know it's just that she didn't really want to play with me anymore. She wasn't even honest about that. And, you know, I give her a home. I give her, you know, these people to play with. And, you know, I was the reason why, you know, she knows these people. But then she makes herself look like the victim. And then, you know, it's like, I don't know what to do anymore. It's like, I'm telling you this. If you're sorry, I'm sorry too. And I get it. You like me as a friend. But just remember, if things don't go out well, I still want to be, you know, that backup plan because I like you a whole lot. And, um, you know, I would want to spend the rest of my life with you. And at least then the stuff like saying, I was saying stuff like I want to totally give up my life for you too, even then. Like, I know you dealt with a hard life and I know you're going to get back surgery. So if, you know, if you watch this video and if we don't talk by then, it's like, I forgive you. Just don't feel bad about it. Just don't feel like a bad person. You know, it's just, I miss you. And I also miss you guys too. But it's just that I just never been hurt like this in a long time. Because I mean, you know, it's like, you don't know if you could trust this person again for what they did and you know, they completely walked away and left you hanging, and it's like, it's like I never meant anything to you. And that's why I said, it's like, I don't know what to even say, it's like, man, I just loved her as a friend so damn much, it's like, even if, like, guys, I'm gonna tell you something right now, so, if she ever, like, lost one of her, or even if she dealt with, like, you know, organ failure, I wouldn't have given up my life to even save her life and that's how much she means to me but then it's like when I made that unlisted video she took everything I said and made it like made it look like completely opposite like made it like you know the stuff that she said sounded bad and um yeah I don't care if they like someone has to share this video on the discord but as I said it's like it's true I liked her and stuff and um you know, it's just I never thought I could care for someone that much, and they completely changed me as a person. They gave me more motivation in life, and, um, you know, there were, in a way, this this person, you know, it's inspired me to at least cherish those people in my life better. Like, she was like, you know, my guardian angel and stuff, and she was a gift and stuff. Kind of the best gift I could ever have in my life, but even though, like, we completely argued over stupid crap anyways, it's like, stuff that shouldn't even had mattered like, like it's like that one time where I cried with her and got very emotional and I will always cherish that moment even if something happens to you even if you're not around or if I'm not around anymore at that time but it's just like I don't even know what else to say you know it's just I will completely miss you and it just I want to forgive you. I want to, but I don't know. I'm, I'm afraid if some things will happen again, you know what I mean? It's like, you pushed me away and you promised you wouldn't even push me away ever. But then you did. It's like it's going to take time to heal up and, you know, I hope I can make up my mind by then, but... The thing is, I also want to move on and, um, you know, it's like I'm not going to... I'm not going to ever retire, you know, from playing Overwatch but it's just that I want to do stuff that I want to do and I'm getting older so I want to do at least more stuff in my future like such as doing more content and that's what I want to do I don't want to be you know playing Overwatch all the damn time I want to become the gaming god and that's what I am you know a man that would break world records in the world or at least attempt it at least be one of the best gamers in the world that's what I want to be but it's just that in a way I'm just telling you right now it really does hurt when you walked away 
and when you completely just pushed me away for no apparent reason. And it's like, I wasn't even laughing at you when, you know, at that point where you, you, I know we brought up this, but I wasn't laughing at you when, you know, some people, you know, that were saying that you weren't even good enough in the group and you said you wanted to leave. You didn't even mention that part. You just, like, I don't know if you're just spreading a lot of lies, but still, it's just, you did. And you caused me to, you know, part ways with the group and you make me not want to come back because people like you just, you know, at least, like, I'm sorry for calling you fake and stuff, and, you know, I still, I still love you, I still, I still do, but you hurt me to a point where, like, I don't even know if I could ever come back, it's like, you viewed me as, as just as a bad person, just like my brother, and I don't even know what else to say anymore, but, it's like, I don't know, I don't want to say farewell, I don't want to say, you know, that I'm gonna go and I'm gonna like whatever but I can promise you right now maybe in the future we'll meet again but not now and that and and I'm telling you guys the same thing too and um yeah anyways um I'll catch you guys later and I hope to see you very soon